to Triple Trouble. My name is Chef, and today I'm going to show you what's in my boat case. So here I am with my boat case. I'm going to open it up for you so you can see what's inside. Uh, I have to look for the zipper. There you have it. Uh, of course, I have everything to build my boat. So I have a pair of limbs, I have a riser, I have my quiver, which I will come back to later. Um, um, I've got stabilizers, uh, just pretty much everything you need to shoot. Uh, but next to the things that you need to shoot, I also have a little case of emergency equipment. So I have sanding paper, a screwdriver, I have a spare uh, arrow rest, just anything you you might need. Um, I have always at least one arrow tube with plenty of arrows, so in my case that's a whole lot, but that's also because I'm testing some stuff, so make sure you have enough arrows to uh, complete a competition, so most competitions outdoors at least are six arrows which means you need seven in my opinion so if you break one you can still continue to shoot then I have a finger sling but I don't have one finger sling I always have a couple so I have a finger sling here I have another finger sling right here on my quiver so just make sure that you have enough spare equipment as well so that if something might break, uh, you're still able to shoot. Then, for maintenance, this is my arrow box. So it's pretty much a bread box that has uh, feathers, points and knocks. So all the components that you might need to fix your arrow at a competition or training. Then I have a bow square, which I think is essential. Um, you always need to bring a bow square with you in case you uh, might have an equipment equipment failure or in case you just want to measure what your brace height is before the competition or to see if anything changes and then I have a bucket cap for sunny weather and then I have just a normal uh, wool cap in case it gets uh, really cold um, some deodorant for the people around me I have some tissues uh, in case you get sweaty hands or in case you spill something and then I always make sure to bring a towel as well to in case it gets rainy or um, if, uh, if something gets spilled over you or whatever you have a towel to dry off your equipment uh, so it doesn't get moldy or uh, rusty because you don't want a rusty bow of course. Um, and for me I have this little dog that reminds me of my girlfriend when I'm uh, not at home. So basically the essentials are just the bow and some spare stuff. Um, and then there's um, many things that you might want to add yourself. So besides my bow case, I also have a quiver to put a lot of stuff in. Um, I have my quiver right here. Um, you can see that I have an arm protector on there. Um, it's always nice to have an arm protector with you. But I also have not one, but two tabs. I think it's, uh, it's important if you're a serious archer to have two of the same tabs. Um, if something happens to your first tab, uh, you can always get your second tab out and still continue shooting. Um, and if you practice with your second tabs every once in a while, uh, you know where the arrow is gonna land in case it's not the same spot. Then, of course, I have an Allen wrench. Um, this Allen wrench is the one by Bider, so it pretty much has anything that I might want to use on my bow. And uh, yeah, that's pretty much it. I have uh, some scissors, a knife, just normal stuff to be able to do some maintenance on your bow if you may need to do maintenance on your bow during competition. So I have a sight as well, of course. Um, I shoot with the XL Achieve RXL carbon bar. Uh, with the sight comes a sight pin. This is my own sight pin, the recurve curve 
uh, RXF um, and I don't have one of them but I have two of them so if I might break something or if I uh, do something wrong with my equipment I have a spare one that I can use in case of emergency or if I have a second bow that I want to build up. Then I also have a biter plunger and I have a second biter plunger. I think that's also important to have a plunger with you that you can, you can use in case uh, something gets jammed or if, uh, if something gets knocked over. If anything might break, I think it's important to have a second one if you're serious about your competitions. I also have a little bit of uh, sun cream, a sunscreen in my bow case uh, in case it gets really sunny all of a sudden and I didn't uh, expect it. So I have this little, little bit. Uh, it doesn't take up too much space but it's nice to have with you. So I have a lot of stuff in my bow case. I think it's very important to have a spare of all the vulnerable parts uh, on your bow and on your arrows uh, to make sure you can always keep shooting no matter the circumstances. Thanks for watching. I hope it was all clear. If it wasn't clear, please let us know down below in the comments. If you liked it, please give us a thumbs up and uh, share it with your friends. I hope you'll be back next week for our second challenge in the new series of challenges that we do. And uh, yeah, see you next time. Sorry. Yeah.